Hello, welcome to today's show. Today we're talking about mag lights. Mag light flashlights. Mini mag. It's the 3D. Mag lights been around since 1979. A great affordable flashlight. They're durable. They're functional. They all have the zoom. They have the zoom. And you can turn it down. They're classic. Everyone, you should have one of these around. You can take the top off here. That's a candle. A few years ago, I went to Wichita, Kansas. This is my friend, uh, Tornado, came along. Him and his kids came to our hotel room. I put this one, this up on the on the on the rail and reflected off the mirror, lit up the whole room, and all the kids were calmed down. You know, so it's a great design. Uh, this one does does the same. You can take the cap off here. This is this, that one. Just sit it there. It's, it's a flashlight. It's a candle. So the little mag light. These are the incandescent ones. It's only 14 lumens. It doesn't seem like a lot, but well, later we'll go outside and show them. It has a 96 meter beam length. That's five hours on two double A's. This has 45 lumens. It has a beam length of 254 meters and it lasts 10 hours. And that's great. I keep this one in my car all the time. Put a reflect piece of tape on it. This one I keep in my little bag I take on holidays. I keep it in my dresser drawer. Like I said, I've had these lights for 25 years. I bought this one and when I, I worked outside on the line to restore the power in my spotlight quit one day. So the next morning I went to the store and I bought one of these. This one fit in the loop of my, my tool belt so then I had it. So that's I've had that long. Perfect for the average person. Everybody should have a mag light. They're great. They last forever and they're dysfunctional. I mean, there's fancier ones with brighter lights that cost more. But most people don't need that. Like I said, I've used these for 25 years. And I go out, I go outside lots at night, work outside at night lots. I have brighter ones and fancier ones, but these ones I, you know, I've always had. I'm gonna make an analogy. Lots of people would like a Rolex watch and they're pretty fancy, and they're pretty accurate, but they cost a lot of money. But for most people, a Timex is a great watch. It's classic, it's affordable, and it's, and it's just as good for most people. You, so to me, the mag lights are like the Timexes of watches. They're affordable, they're classic, they're good value for money thinking about getting a flashlight to keep forever, think about a mag light. In my next show I'm going to go over my uh, other flashlights as well. I have, I have a little night eyes one. It works. Works fine. I had a problem with this one. It's my daughter's. And it doesn't work all the time. So I wrote that in a letter. They sent me a new one. I have a four sevens. Quark Pro. It's a great light. We'll talk about that another time. So we're, for the next few shows we're going to talk about flashlights. Let's go outside and have a look at these. And we'll come back. See you outside. Alright, let's see if we can... Here's the mini mag. There. So those trees are about 10 meters away. Oh, you can see here, let's her up. Just my deck here, it's two couple meters away. It's going down to the tree, it's 10 meters away. It's out in the field, can you see it out in the field there? There, you can see it out in the field, 20. 
you can dial it in. Swing over to my garden shed. Yeah, there. Look at that. 15 meters. You can see the reflect of that bike. You can there it's 15 meters away. That's as much flashlight as anybody ever needs. Yeah, that's 15 meters away. Lights up that easy. All right, let's get the big one. All right, you see the big difference there. It's just a bigger beam. It's 100 and some lumens, 140 lumens here. Look at that, that's a lot bigger. Let's go that those, those are the trees 10 meters away. You can see way out in the field there. Bottom of the tree is farther out. Look at that. It's a great light for the car. It's got a beam length of 100 some meters, but my it has a beam length of 150 meters. But the camera's not really picking that up. But you can see everything you need to see here. These are great flashlights, classic flashlights. They last you forever. It's a good ones to have. Let's go back inside. Okay, and we're back. So like I said before, those are great flashlights. They have new LED versions that I'm sure are great. I don't know that, I don't have one, but I know those incandescent ones have lasted me a long time. All right, if you have any comments, put them down below. If you like our content, hit the subscribe button, and thanks for watching.